Hey everybody, how you doing? This is Chad the Gaming Dad here on Dad's Games, and today we're taking a look at Old Time Hockey. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's right, Old Time Hockey. This thing just came out. I got it on PS4, and uh, it's kind of a budget title. It's not very expensive, about 12 bucks, I think. Which, depending on how much you like Old Time Hockey, it may or may not be too high a price for this thing, but let's take a look at it anyway. So here we go. Got my controller. I'm ready to play some old time hockey. Ah, can't play like this. It's time to drop the gloves. This is hockey. This is hockey. All right, so old time hockey. I don't know if you guys out there have ever seen a movie from the 70s. It's called Slapshot. And uh, if you haven't watched it, you really should if you like hockey or sports movies at all, because it's funny as hell. But this game is called Old Time Hockey. They may as well just call it Slapshot the Game, because uh, maybe they already have a Slapshot the Game. I can't remember. But I'm going to be the Portage Lake Widowmakers. Let's do it. But in Slapshot the Movie, you're like a Bush League team that's terrible and you know they get better and all that good stuff so it's in the 70s nobody's wearing helmets it's old time hockey they got the, you know the three Hanson brothers you guys have heard of, probably heard of the Hanson brothers if you're a hockey fan you've heard of the hands yeah if you're a hockey fan you've heard of the Hanson brothers I guarantee it if you're a hockey player you totally know what slap shot is because it's a thing if you're a hockey player when you're out on the ice, a lot of people like to say things from the movie. Even though it's an old movie, it's still pretty accurate. <laughs> so anyway, old time hockey is what the Hanson brothers say in that movie. And that's what that movie's all about. It's like the gritty, hardcore, no fans in the stands, just Bush League type stuff. Welcome to Longhouse Arena. Tonight's Welcome to the Longhouse Arena. The Portage Lake Widowmakers and the Schuylkill Hinto Brews. Let's get ready for I'm not hockey. sure whether I really like the cell shaded look or not. And obviously the crowd and everything looks terrible. This is fairly like PS2 era type stuff, but I think they were going for a very retro. Oh, boom! They were going for a very retro feel on this thing, and they did it. They did it. Shoot. Walters Shoot it. Right. shoots in low. Huge stop. But honestly, the play of this game feels an awful lot like playing on your Sega Genesis. You know, like NHL 96, 95, all those good ones back then. You know, the the famous movie, what is it, Swingers or something, where they're playing hockey and you smash the guy's head on the ice and they're going to make Gretzky bleed and all that good stuff. So, it's very very reminiscent of that. Oh, got a breakaway. No. Okay, good goal. Ay, ay, ay. The other thing with this game is just like the old NHL games of the past, I can't, I can't score when I'm skating down. I can do it when I go up. And, I mean, you could set it so that you're always aiming up, but uh, it seems like it should alternate and make it tough for you sometimes. Come on! Now, so far, what you're seeing here, like I said, looks a lot like NHL. Although it does have the stick controls from the newer NHL games, which is cool. But you can also go ahead and select different modes. All right, let's look at some of the controls here. You've got a couple different options for controls, which is nice. The advanced is the one that has the most things that you can do. You use the stick for the shot, similar to the newer NHL game. Uh, there's the defense. You can fight a lot in this game, but it's not very exciting. <laughs> it's, it's fun, but it's real simple. One button to punch, one button to dodge. You have to hit the guy three times to knock him down. All right, ground and pound. You do get to beat the crap out of him once he's on the ground, though, which is really nice. All right, so we got retro offense. This is just the two buttons, similar to a Genesis, very similar to a Genesis. And then the two button, which is kind of the same thing. And here we go, beer mode. Like I said, beer mode. You get your drink in your hand? This is coffee. 
in this, you can do everything on just one hand and drink while you play. Good stuff. So now it's time to score, because we're aiming up. I don't think anybody likes scoring aiming down. Maybe they did. Maybe I did. I can't remember. See, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Boom. Oh, he... Last second. Got the stick in there for the poke check. Easter. Take him out. Ah, he dodged it. Dodged it. Goalies don't hang on to the puck too much in this one. Another chance. Not a lot of face-offs. <laughs> in fact, I can't remember the goalie ever doing that. There you go. Oh, he's hurt. He's got the birdies. And boom. Oh, man, I was on fire, too. There you go. You got the birdies, too, pal. To Schwinn. He lets it go. Whoa. To O'Sullivan. Great save. Nice save by the goalie. A kick save and a butte. How did he stop that one? He rips it. They can't seem to get out of their zone. Ah. Another great chance. We're not really getting it out of the zone here. Come on, out, out, out. Gets clocked. There we go. See if we can do a little trickery here. Pass, shoot, yes! Absolutely! Yeah, that's right. Dust it off. You're the man. Whoa! Well, get, get it, no! <laughs> oh yeah, look at that. A little bit of blood left on the ice. Blood flows red on the ice. Oh, that was a high one. Oh, nailed him. him down. See, look at that crowd, folks. Look at that crowd. They've really come out today to support their team. There's a few different, few different arenas that are in this game and different environments that you can play in. Uh, most of which look a lot like my men's league. <laughs> Take him out. Take him out. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yes! Scars. What that worked in NHL 95. It works here. The Portage Lake Widowmakers extend their lead. Fenton wins the faceoff. Uh-oh. There's a fight brewing. I saw some boxing gloves back there. Here it goes. Oh, let's do this. You're mine, baby. Ooh. Two. Three hits. And now we pummel. Pummel. Just beat the living crap out of him on the ground. Oh, man, he's dazed. <laughs> night, night. All right, so we got exhibition game, and then you got story mode. Leaderboards. Who's the best at old-time hockey? I don't think there's any online on this, which is great. Extras. We got the collectibles. Yeah. As you go through the story mode, you unlock little collectibles like this one. Cliff Parnassus. Hey, he's the center. Just stupid stuff to collect. There's also the soundtrack, which is lovely. Can't really show you a whole lot of soundtrack here on YouTube due to the fact that uh, they're really cool about that, but... Trust me, there's some really weird stuff in here. Just like this one. This is a great one. The Good Old Hockey Game by Stompin' Tom. Definitely. How about this one here? Oh, yeah. My favorite band, The Bitch Boys. All right, let's head up story mode. Let's do a new story mode. Yeah, new story mode. You could be a noob. Casual or the hardcore. See, this is how you can tell whether you're casual, you know, newbie or hardcore. Watch the stash. No mustache. Growing one. Full on porn stash. That's when you're hardcore. I'm casual. I'm not quite there yet. All right. So you start off your story mode. Now you'll notice the thing that says zero, zero, zero. That has like the stick, the shield and the fighting. As you go through the games, you 
You'll see. Here, I'll show you in a sec. As you go through the games, they give you things that you're supposed to do. Little, I don't know, objectives during the game. If you get those, it adds to the abilities that you have in either skills, the defense, or the fighting. And it's pretty cool. But the Brews are struggling this season and find themselves in last place. It's the Pottsville Post. December 17th of 1975. Very nice. So here we go. We're getting ready for our first game. The Brews have been drinking and smoking before the game. Yeah, that happens. All our stuff, our calendar. Let's just go into this first game. We must hit Cliff Parnassus when he's on the ice, take 20 or more shots, and only allow six goals or less. This is the best part about these objectives. Note! Winning games is not required unless it's a primary objective. So we just can't lose by more than six. Or, well, yeah, lose by six. Well, look at these guys. They've already got some stats. The Charlestown Stonemasons. I hate to keep bringing it up, but the Charlestown Chiefs were the team in Slapshot. Wow, look at that crowd. The capacity is 2,800. They may have 28. Barry Walters has made little impact yeah. this season. I think I need to work on some games. of my... I got to do my haircut more like a 70s goal, hockey we'll player. Play All right, here we go. We must hit Cliff Parnassus. He's that Kicking center the with the pink helmet on. See him? He Destroy him. Go. Hit the post. I'm not even paying attention to the rest of the game. Winning is not the objective here. Although it's nice to try to win. Come on. To gold. Boom. Ah, that wasn't a good enough hit. Shot away. Barely. Hit the crossbar. Hit, get it. Get it. Oh, chance. man, these it's guys the stink. Iron. They're controlling the play in this one. They have the hey, there's Cliff Parnassus. To Dao. To Parnassus. Hey, there's Parnassus. Let's hit him. Hit him. Hit him. Takes a chance. Huge stop. To Sterling. To Walters. Very, very nice. Uh, yeah. Wow. Goalie was badly beaten on that one. The scoop. Throw your sticks. This is bad behavior hockey. Too sharply. Always got to watch out the pink helmet guy. There you go. That's more of a check. We like that better. The cuckoo noises and Scooby Doo sound effects I could probably do without. But it's okay. I love that crowd. Look at that crowd. There's one, two, three. Four, five, six people in the crowd tonight. I really do think I had more people at my men's league games. Fenton wins. There we go. There we go. We're still on fire, which is nice. The fire holds over from one period to the next. Whoa, careful. Whoa. Oh, I knocked out the ref, too. Sharply lets it go. Kick save. Come on, come back for it. Come back for it. Sharply. Here we go. Give him a little nudge. To Fenton. Passes Whoops, down. wrong button. To Atkinson, the oh, the referee is out again. <laughs> uh, that's Parnassus. I have to hit him, and I just did. I, no, come on. Not on goal. There you go. Enjoy that, Parnassus. I already hit you for the for the objective, but that one was just for fun. Watch out. Dao clocks him. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, oh! Oh, baby! Lockhead with the enormous save. Oh, oh, oh! Fight time, fight time! Two! Three! Oh, he dodged it! No! Get no, don't get me! Ah. The crowd is unhappy to see this one going this way. I don't I don't press the dodge punches. button very often. I usually go straight off. Ah, fight number two. Oh, you hit me already, did you? Williams with a solid And he hit me three times already. This one is over. The cheers are into Pierre Beating the living daylights out of Barney Williams. Now he must be hardcore because he's got the full stash. Oh! And a salute! Look at the great detail on all those players in the crowd. Peace nice work. Wins the draw. Ah! To the Convy. 
This is definitely a art style they were going for on this thing as I get scored on again. The goalie guessing. The Charlestown Stonemasons extend their lead. Apparently everyone in the 70s looked like that. Peace wins the faceoff. Goodbye. Ah, uh, give me back my puck. This guy's either hurt or tired. That's why he's got the skull and cross hockey sticks there. They could use a whistle. Oh, I'm getting schooled here. Good thing that winning isn't one of the objectives. We got two of our objectives. We hit Parnassus. And we stopped them from scoring six. All right, everybody. So there's a quick look at old-time hockey on the PS4. Certainly not the worst the hockey game, game I've ever played, nor is it the best. <laughs> it's just kind of unique, it's different, it's pretty cheap on the PSN, and I bet you it'll be on sale pretty soon if it doesn't sell like hotcakes. But hey, the NHL playoffs are starting, and if you got a buddy at home and you want to sit and just and play kind of an old school Sega Genesis style old and hockey game... Where you can just hurt each other, knock each other out, hit the refs, do all kinds of stupid stuff, hooking and spearing and slashing and all that fun stuff. And some real basic fighting mechanics. It's okay. It's a good game for that. Uh, it's not going to set the world on fire. NHL series from EA doesn't have any worries with this one, but for a cool retro style, it's not bad. Kind of fun for a laugh every now and then. So anyway, till next time, everybody, remember, you never outgrow video games. My name's Chad the Gaming Dad, and this is Dad's Games. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you on the next one. So long, everybody. Thanks again for watching. If you liked that video, please press like and subscribe. I love hearing from you guys, so leave your comments and any suggestions down below. Remember, there's tons of other gamers out there just like you and me, and they also know that you never outgrow video games. Feel free to share these videos all over social media, Twitter, Facebook, or whatever you use. This channel is for all of us. Let's make sure they know that they are not alone. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.